And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Rise of Industry. All right. Now, I did a little work in between episodes. Well, right over here. So we are using a little bit of our thorium for the bio LEDs. And um, the thorium itself is only used in bio LEDs and thorium rods. So we had 36 thorium extra being produced in this in this chain right here okay so i thought why not go crazy and make some thorium rods with that so that's what i did um basically since we have 36 extra thorium a month that means these use two a month which means there are 18 thorium rod makers okay that's a lot. We have a lot of thorium rod makers, which is glorious. So I'm happy about that. So we have a metric ton of thorium rod makers. And that means we would be able to literally have 18 of these a month. That's, that's, that's a good goal to have. These things are pretty good. Um, and then, so we need at least 18 hodogram and I still don't know where that word comes from um, um, But it's also used in that superconductor as you can see superconductor and I know I know we are gonna need that superconductor um, so, oh, Just clicking all the things uh, we're gonna need that superconductor somewhere in here now. Where is it? I there it is superconductor uh, that's a 30-day craft, uh, making two. So why not plan on having quite a lot of these hodogram, I don't know, like 24 or something like that? Like, just go crazy. Um, so uh, how, much re how many resources are we going to need? Probably quite a bit um, for these. Uh, let's see. Uh, hodogram. There it is. <clears throat> so titanium, steel, and gold well we have here four steel grabbers four steel re ruin scraper guys okay so that is 10 20 30 40 steel per month coming just from what i have here and i'm not even like there's a whole lot of steel that i could grab from here so if we want to just go insane crazy with production of this hodogram stuff we're going to need a substantial amount of resources um so i know for a fact that we're going to need 36 no we're going to need 18 how many it's just no i want to see i want to see the nuclear duvalakis um no uh, no materials uh no Robotics? Where's the nuclear thingy McDougal? Um, it was basic components. I just am blind. Um, so we have 30, no, no, 18 of these a month that we're making. So we need a minimum of 18 a month of the hodogram. And these produce two at a time. So that is. Uh, what is that? Nine crafters just for the just for the um, just for the cells. Nine crafters for the cells. Now we're gonna need a, a set number of cells. Um, we might need. Well, we can only do nine, right? So nuclear power cells, thorium rods. I have 18 of these. So that's 18 a month of these. No, we're producing, oh. We're producing two at a time. I didn't even notice that. Oh, man. So we're producing 36 thorium rods a month. So we're gonna go, we're gonna have to go insane crazy on the amount of hodogram that we're going to be producing 
because I want to produce as many of these as I possibly need because we're going to need, need a lot of them. Um, oh, man, 36 of those. Okay, maybe we don't need 36. Let's let's dial down these fuel cells. Oh, see, I, I want as many fuel cells as possible. In part, in case that stupid debuff comes up and says, hey, you know, give me 50 of these things or I'm going to kill your factories. That's, that's hurt production by a lot. Um, so if we want a base of 36 a month of these, because we don't think we have anything else. Yeah, thorium rods, really not used anywhere else. So hodogram, these things are going to be crazy. I might need to do these in two different sets just because of how much logistically we're going to have to move. Um, I mean, we have plenty of gold on the map. It's just a matter of moving it where it's needed. Same with titanium. We have a lot of titanium over here. We just need to get it moved. Speaking of which, you are going to be 200%. You are going to be 200%. And you are going to be 200%. All right, um, I'm thinking down in here is probably the best place to start this. Um, let's start with this. This is going to be Hoda, Hoda G1. Okay, so I want like a substantial amount of this stuff. No, wrong button. No, that's also the wrong button. There's the right button. Um, build this building. Give ourselves a little bit of space. Uh, Hoda or rep. So, huh, what are the base max of these that I want to deal with here. That is one, two, three, four, five. Um, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Right there. Oh, that's the wrong direction. Yeah, see, come on. So, there's a, there's a certain number of these that we're going to want to avoid because, man, this, this can get really crazy really fast. Um, we go out like that. The other thing we can do, give, us our, give ourselves a little bit of space, is bump that up to 40. And now we've got quite a large area that we can grab from. Um, so we might need... See, this guy's got just a thing on there for airships. We are probably going to want... Hoda G1. Um, how many of these do we um, remember, we're going to need 36 just baseline. So that means nine of these is going to be 18. Um, makes two at a time. So nine makes 18. 18 makes 36. I, mm, that's almost, well, as long as we design these right, if we do 6, 12, 18... And then we double that. Um, but then we have enough room for more. And I think we're going to want uh, two, three, four, five, 
six. How did, did I mess that up somehow? Please tell me I, I set the destination first. Oh, thank God. Um, all right, so let's get this out. Okay, so that is one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's 18. And we remember, we're gonna want a little bit more of this stuff because it is used in superconductors. So maybe another six. We'll max this out. Right that. So that's six, twelve, that's twenty-four, which is forty-eight um hoda a month crafting out of here. It's just a lot. That's a lot of crafting. Um, all right, we are going to want to redo this, this road. Um, we're going to want to bend you out. And up. And then I should be able to clear that. The game does prevent you. Oh, let's clear all that. Oh, I didn't mean to take that out. Okay, um, because we're going to need a ton of rail and uh, I can feed. I can feed the gold from here right into here. There's no reason to have a middleman here. 200 percent. gold right in there okay <clears throat> how about the gold from down here remember this is this is 48 um, doubling this is gonna give me 20 a month so we're gonna need one of these in order to make that work um, so I want to bring this road right in here instead Ah, auto save. Yeah, get there. We go. Uh, all right, you. Two hundred. Hey, it saved the, it saved the percentage. Okay, destinations. You're set. You are going to be gold for Hoda. Gold for Hoda. It's it's really saving my sanity not having to um, number all of these. Remember remember when I did my main series, I would do Hoda for rep one, and then two, and then three, and then four, and I was like, okay, that's enough of that. <laughs> that shenanigans was uh, was not helping my sanity at all. Uh, so we want a train terminal. Definitely want a train terminal here. Um, and then we're going to want a air terminal over here. Doesn't really matter where that's facing. Um, and then we can connect you and you. So 48 is 12 more than the 36 that we need. So is that going to be enough for the superconductors? Um, oh, that was the superconductor uh, here. No, must have been this one superconductor. So we're gonna have 12 extra here, which is going to be Yeah, we're gonna have plenty 24. Yeah, 24 superconductors a, a month. That's I think that's going to be plenty. That's like 24 of these. That's actually 48 of these theta raw processors 60 day craft. That's 48 of those. 
Um, and then these are, it's even worse. So yeah, we're going to have plenty. So we need a little bit more gold over here, um, which I can grab from over here. So gold, I want to send over to here. I want to make sure this is going to be sitting at 32 uh, and only send when you are good to go. Um, and the gold wire, that will be used uh, soon. That will be used soon. But this is a is a is just a massive amount of hoda. Um, now what we can do is somehow get a this thing in here. Because uh, trains can move far more volume cheaper. And since we're just moving like steel, I'm, I really don't want to have uh, too much of the of the ickies. Okay, so <sighs> what we're going to do is we're going to go out and out. Well, yeah. Leave myself a little space here. See what I mean? The game just does not like... I wish I could click on track to copy it. That would be really handy. Okay, so we don't need too much more there. Um, let's bridge over that. Let them sort it out. Uh, all right, so we're going to want to move steel over here uh, via train. And we're going to want to move all the titanium over here via train. And only when you're full. Okay, so very, very cheap way. I've already bumped up this titanium to 200%. I am going to need to send this titanium over, at least a little bit of it, over to here via airship, unfortunately. Because there's no room to put in a train stop over here. You have to put it somewhere in that short radius, and yeah, that, that's taken up. Um, so we're also going to need some more gold. I think I've already set that up. Yep, I set that up already. Excellent. So that's gonna that's an expensive little build right there. Um, I just spent almost seventeen million building this. I do like how the the trains just <laughs> oh, don't mind me. Um, So they're leaving out of the bottom one here, and they're going into the top one. Um, I mean, I could have, well, if, if we really want to make this, like, super efficient, I guess I could do something like this. Um, oh, my. Really? How about undo that? Oh, I can't undo that. Are you serious? Thanks, game. Uh, you.
There we go. Now, I mean, we're, we're making it. Oh, we are making a lot of it. Um, this is going to fill up rather fast with all the things. <clears throat> um, at the very least. Oh, we're still full. That's amazing. There was a lot sitting over here ready to be used. So I'm glad about that. So we have 48, 6, 12, yeah, 48. I'm writing this down. Hoda production. 36 is going to go into nuclear cells. Okay. So we're going to have an excess of uh, 14. Roughly. I thought it was 12. No, 12. Of course. 12. 14 did not sound right in my head. I don't know why I said it. Um. There we go. Keeping them separate. <clears throat> That's fine. All right. So we have lots of gold coming in, which is excellent. Wow, there's still eight sitting there. Didn't I send like all of it? Oh no, I guess I I guess I limited that. Um, let's like let's send like all of it or most of it because the the airship coming in here will only send when it drops below a certain threshold. So I want to make sure that we're prioritizing these two mines over everything else. All right, first Hoda is done. Um, and now, if we look, no, at the recipe book. Um, do, 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 basic components was right there. Now we have the thorium rods and we have the Hoda somewhere over here. And I think what we could do is build this in the vicinity because all of those nuclear fuel rods can come down here and basically add into this production and then I can use the train to move over and make you know move all the hoda over and, and make the the fuel rods a little bit more efficiently because this chain here this is going to be my arms all of the arms the limbs um the utility I think it's utility cyber I don't know I don't know which arm it is, but maybe it's auxiliary arm extension. That might be it. And laser controls. Oh, man, so many things use this. If you exclude the bots, I don't think we're going to need the heavy lifting cyber leg. Uh, but the laser control system um, and the auxiliary arm extension are both going to be using these fuel rods. So that's why I wanted a lot of these um it is a oh there's so many over here yeah our first craft got done and it's almost full the next craft gets done it will be full so there's a lot of construction a lot of crafting over there and it ain't cheap it's really these things are really cutting in to my income because of that but we're working towards getting that eight hundred thousand a month arm um, which is the red, the red arm, I believe. Yeah, this is used in the structural disassembler, which is right here. We have a place to sell these, and we can sell them for a lot. So I'm looking forward to that. All right, well, that is going to do it for this episode, and I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.